today we are going to be doing a bleach retouch. Um, I have not seen my girl in quite some time, so um, we'll see how her roots are. But she likes to go silver, so if this sounds interesting to you, we're going to go step by step on how I do the bleach retouch, how I apply it, how long I leave it on for, the toner I use, and of course the outcome. Modern Blonde with two E's. Well, her roots aren't as bad as what I thought they were going to be, but we are going to go ahead and get started, sectioning her off into four sections, and we are going to be using Blonde Me and 7 volume at a 1 to 1.5 one ratio. I'm going to start in one of the back sections and outline the full section before I start flipping the hair forward. My sectioning is going to be see-through, and I'm going to saturate so I don't see any of the regrowth. I'm going to saturate to the line of demarcation and place a cotton right where the demarcation ends. The reason for the cotton is because the lightener swells and we don't want to get it on her previously lightened hair. The cotton acts as a barrier and stops the lightener from going any further. We will then finish the section all the way down. Here I wanted to show you how much lightener we actually used. On that one quadrant we used a hundred grams. Don't be afraid to use a lot of lightener, heavy saturation is going to give you the most lift. We are then going to do the same thing on the front but I am going to make sure that I do that that middle part because it gets less heat. My ratio for the front on both sides is going to be a one to one ratio of one part lightener, one part seven volume, and then the other half, I'm actually gonna use 13 volume. Since the back was sitting on there for longer, I wanna make sure that the front catches up, but we're not also using too heavy of a lift. And voila, this is what she looks like. We had her sit for literally an hour, and look at that. Look at those roots. Banana yellow is what they wanna look like. Pulling these out, I do use my rat tail comb to get these out of the hair, it's so much cleaner. And wow, so beautiful. Now we get to toning. This is what she's gonna look like, all washed out. And here is the formula. I ended up using Schwarzkopf Igora Royal, and I used 70 grams of 9 51, 45 grams of 811, and 30 grams of 011, all with six volume gel. I am going to apply this all to her roots, again, just like we did with everything else. We're gonna do the roots first and then we're gonna pull everything all the way through. Making sure it's nice and saturated. I actually do use a little bit of a comb and I use my hands to make sure it's all in there. You wanna make sure that you're getting it so saturated that you don't miss any hair. I use the front, I pull it back, and I left this on for about 20 minutes. It's gonna look super dark, but that's exactly how you want it to be and you don't wanna rinse it out too soon. This is what she's going to look like wet, and then once we blow dry her, this is what the outcome is. If this is what you liked watching, make sure you hit that subscribe button, that like button, and give me some feedback in the comments. What did you like? What did you learn? I'll see you guys next time.